Hello again, internet. And today we have an unboxing video. Um, I'm gonna try to do these more often um, because they seem to be kind of popular on my channel and everywhere on YouTube. Um, but today we're unboxing one of these bad boys. It's a tripod. I'm especially gonna try to you know unbox things that improve my life and you know stuff like that and this tripod will help me do videos because the current tripod I have is currently a piece of shit uh, all it's good for really right now without any help or other factors is a selfie stick because it's it's supposed to double as a selfie stick and it came with this Bluetooth remote and it's the Bluetooth remote works great now, I don't have any complaints about that I only had to replace the battery I think once and that was because I put it in something else temporarily. But um, yeah, so literally what I've done is I've just taken it out of the Amazon box here, the bottle on Amazon, and the bubble wrap. Yeah, cool shit. And um, yeah, I bought this thing on Amazon for like $26 plus two day shipping. And um, yeah, hopefully this works out better because the one I have right now is it's all black and it's really skinny and the legs are really skinny too. This one's like, I think it stands taller than this one does. This, uh, and this one's got a little bit more support. So we'll see. I don't know. So we'll just try to open it up here. I don't know if I need my knife anymore or not. We'll see. They're supposed to give you like a whole bunch of little knickknacks too. Yeah, okay, here we go. All right, so first thing you get on the top is the phone holder itself. A little Ziploc bag. Oh, okay. And it's got on the bottom here where the one side of the phone goes, it's got little rubber grippers and on the other side it's got the same thing little grips and then this can I'm sure this is gonna have to go like almost all the way up I don't know what this is for oh this is to lift the phone out itself but I'm pretty sure this one's gonna have to go all the way up because I have a six plus and we'll we'll fuck with it when <laughs> um, we actually have to use the thing all right so we got that out and there's a little instruction book so that's that's the main party right there we'll wait for that in just a second all right that's all we got in the box and then they give you an instruction booklet here and it says the functional diagram here it's only one sided of course uh, that's all it really needs to be but it says Functional diagram has uh, four legs, uh, has leg locks for each level, because you can put it up on three levels. That, this one's the same thing, kind of. Uh, it's got a bubble level on it, uh, 14 inch, 1 14 screw. It's got a lock and release so you can lock the, the spinny part of it. And it's got a rubber knob, which is what I just did with this little thing. And yeah, so we'll see what we can get here. This is probably wrapped up in plastic too. Yeah, I can already see it. Is this bag ripped? I think the bag is ripped. Well, ain't that just fucking worthless? <laughs> This bag, I'm probably not going to use this bag like ever, but let's see what we got here. This bag is already, it's not ripped. I think it's supposed to look like this, but this other part down here has threads that are coming out of the bottom, sl the slit in the bag, which this bag feels cheap as fuck too. I don't know. We'll see. What we got going on here? It's 
smells weird. Okay. Oh, those look skinny as hell too. This is the big one. Oh Jesus! <laughs> All right, we're getting we're getting big. We're getting big. We're gonna extend the whole thing for you here. This one seems like a little hard to come out. It's probably got some rubber in it or something. Will this fit in this section right here? I'm hoping it will. Okay, well, that works. It's a little shaky, but because it's got this support in the middle, I think it'll still do better. Uh, so we got... Oh, this lifts up too. Okay, I didn't know that. All right, how do you... I apologize in advance because I'm trying to figure this fucking thing out. How do you lock this part? Oh, okay, I got it. I got it, don't worry. Don't worry, I got it. I got it, don't worry, I got it. Yeah, okay. Okay, I'm actually going to have to lower this. Well, no, I can see it. Uh, surprised they don't give you a, a like this one came with like you could put a different mount on it and it was just a screw this one's like it looks like it only works with one thing and not that I'm you know displeased with that but it's just a little weird all right so we got this thing figured out Almost. Let's extend it up here. Uh, so what I did was this thing has a lot of these twisty things here, um, like a lot. This thing is fucking tall. I didn't think it was gonna be this tall. Okay. Uh, okay, so that controls that. It spins. That's all I fucking need. Okay. Um. So, I don't know if you can see that in camera. Let me lower it down. Come down, bitch. All right. So, this thing, you can do this whole number. You can do this whole number. Uh, you can make this part fold in if you take and twist this knob. And actually, I need to tighten it a little bit more. Um, and then the other part folds down. There's a washer in here that makes this lock up so where it doesn't, you know, jerk. And then there's another twisty part right up in here. You can probably see it right there. It holds this onto here. So there's a lot of twisting. <laughs> uh, you don't really need any tools to set this thing up, though, which is kind of, you know, remarkable for how messed up this thing can get um doesn't seem to be giving way the locks seem to be pretty strong but yeah um we'll see here uh we're gonna cut the video right here and we're gonna put you on the new tripod and see how it goes all right all right so um this is the old tripod i don't remember if i ever made a video um, unboxing this thing I think I did I'm not sure but this thing gets pretty small uh, this thing came straight out of China the good thing about this one was you can move this thing back and forth like spin it that was that was the loose part I mean you can and it had springs in it to where it would clamp down but and it would move back and forth but the problem with this thing is it's good build quality until you get to this part right here. So what happened with this was this part, I'm not going to take it off. And you probably can't see it on camera, but I can see it right here in front of my face. 
there's a chunk of plastic that's missing right here and uh, it just screws in. Well, somehow it, that chipped off and it won't stand up straight. I mean, if it's at low, if it's low like it is right now, it's decent. But then the, the taller you make it, the more out of control it gets. So we'll make it all the way up. And I think this thing is actually just a tad bit taller, but I don't really need to be that tall. So, cause I never used the third level for it. So yeah, but you see how this is, let me see if I can get level. It's like, okay, this is level, right? And it gets all sideways and you can't really tell what it looks like until you're on the camera and it's like oh shit it's sideways and then when the phone's on here and it's leaning this way the thing it will actually fall over so we don't need that so uh, I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do with this thing I might if you can take this and loosen it And then put these up. And I could probably just take that part off. And you can use it as a selfie stick because there's a grip right here. And you can just go and, you know, boom, selfie stick right here. Boom. Bang. Um, but yeah, and it's got a little mirror on it too, which I thought was interesting. But it doesn't have a level. So there, there's a lot of things I'm switching out. Um, for this tripod but this one's a lot better the build quality itself on this tripod feels a lot cheaper the new one but i mean if that thing's a piece of shit that ain't gonna work and this one works even though it feels cheap then whatever um we'll worry about this one fucking up and not working when it doesn't work anymore uh and then we'll get something a little bit more professional maybe something that's about in the 50 dollar range it should be all I have to do. Um, or we'll get something that's an actual camera, maybe. Which is going to be about $500, $800. But I'm not going to worry about that right now because I'm not YouTube famous. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's fine. Uh, so remember, like, comment, favorite, subscribe. Like the Facebook page will be linked down below in the description. Go like uh, and view the Daily Motion uh, channel and videos. Uh, that'll be linked down below in the description. Um, Vimeo, I think I'm going to stop using Vimeo. Um, and also, I've got some stuff to talk to you guys about uh, that's happened here in the past couple days. So, yeah, we're going to try to do that. Bye for now.